Yo, what's good, Tree Stands and Tree Fam? So today, why am I talking like that? We're gonna check out Sean Mendez singing Lost in Japan live at the AMAs. I have not heard this song, so I am super excited to hear it. And yes, I am wearing a monkey suit, just in case any of y'all are wondering. And yes, I am a vocal coach. Be sure you check me out at youcansinganything.com because I teach singing lessons online every single day. Also, check me out on Instagram, Twitter, and also my vlog channel. I swear to God, I don't have an accent. I'm just talking like this for the video. But anyway, before y'all get too annoyed with me, let's just get started. Here we go. Sean Mendes singing Lost in Japan. I don't know what this boy's doing in Japan and why he's so lost, but we're gonna find out. Someone better f help him find his way out. <laughs> Love his voice, by the way. Ooh, some jazz? Okay. I'm ready for it. It's life. Something I love about Shawn Mendes' voice and what makes it so distinct is that most pop singers in their lower range, they're super breathy, but Shawn Mendes ain't breathy down there. I'm a couple hundred miles from Japan tonight And I was thinking I could fly to and, and I was thinking, and I was thinking He's like, uh, sorry, <laughs> it probably sounds terrible But uh, the point is that he's not breathy down there Whereas someone like a Bieber or a Weekend, They would tend to be more, definitely more breathy at the bottom there See your hotel tonight, baby Baby no breath. My my. Okay, sorry. Anyway. It just gives his voice such presence. All right, a little bit of funk. That falsetto though is really sexy. And I, I'm about, I'm about. He like has that like eh going on the whole time he's singing, even in the low range, you know what I'm saying? Sorry. Shawn Mendes fans hate me. Ooh. And I was thinking I could fly to your hotel tonight, darling. But I can't get you off my mind. Can't get you off my mind. Can't get you off my mind. Ooh. Oh! I like this. This is so different from anything else he's done. We love a developing sister. Do you got plans tonight, baby? I'm a couple hundred miles. Here he gets breathy, and that's what creates this. This gives us a much more intimate feel compared to the rest of it. The rest of it was a little bit more aggressive, but here it gets more intimate. Not only does the piano and all the instruments get more intimate and more sparse and more like minimalistic, but his voice also uh, gets breathy. Do you got this now, baby? And he, he transitions that perfectly. Like right here, there's a lot of instrumentation, so he doesn't want the breathiness because his voice is gonna be overshadowed by the instruments. So that's fairly aggressive, not super aggressive. Do you got? And then he's gonna go, plants night, baby. Breath. A couple hundred miles from Japan, and I, I was thinking I still some power in it, but also a little bit of breath to give it that intimacy, but also it's still Shawn Mendes. So he's not gonna go full out, I got a couple. He's not gonna go all, all in that direction. I could fly to your hotel. But I can't seem to get you off my mind, yeah. Ooh, those runs. I love this. We love an international singer. Japan, doesn't matter where you're from. Trumpets. 
He's been using his falsetto a lot lately, and his falsetto is something that he does bring a lot of breath into. Whether it's that song, Nervous, I get a little bit nervous, or this song, he loves the, like, there's not a lot of breath in his low range, or in his upper range, unless he's using his falsetto, in which case he's almost always breath. <laughs> That was great. I can't seem to get you off my mind. The other thing I, I suppose to notice here is that he's only using a small portion of the stage, whereas Taylor Swift used for example, use the entire stage, but he wants to have more of an intimate feeling because the song is kind of an intimate song with intimate moments. It's not this epic banger like Taylor Swift's performance, I did something bad. He wants that more intimate feel, not only for the tele, well, I guess it's mostly for the television because there's a lot of the audience that doesn't get to actually participate in this considering it's such a small little space here. But that's just one other interesting thing to note is that he's trying to create an intimate effect, not only vocally with like the more breathy falsettos and like the sparse instrumentation, but also in terms of the visuals, he wants a small intimate looking set. Um, whereas other performers tonight didn't go for that. They went for something more high key, but Shawn Mendes went for something low key. But anyway, I'm a monkey. <laughs> And until next time, Tristans and Trist fam, be sure you check out my website, my Twitter, my Instagram, and also my vlog channel. And until next time, peace out.